Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hi, my name's Claire. My channel's called My Mad Little World because I'm a little bit kooky, but I am a nice person. I'm 21 years old and I have a five month old son called Oliver. I've tried filming this video three times, but every single time I've tried to film it, I've been interrupted somehow. That or my camera's cut out. Um, so I'm going to do my skincare routine today. So this one could be a long video, but the products, personally, I think are worth it. I've used them for a while. Um, I would consider some of these Holy Grail products. Some of them I've just started to try out, so God knows what it's like. Um, first thing I'm going to use is these. The Naturally Radiant Glycolic Acid Cleansing Pads from Superdrug. I don't quite know how much some of these things are. So what I'm going to do is link everything down below what I've used. One of these is a sample, so when I link it down below it will be the full size product, but it is just a sample. So what I do is I go round in circles around the face down the bridge of the nose and that's the cleansing pad juice done. The second thing I'm, I use is the Kind and Gentle Cleansing Lotion by Asda, which it is quite a cheap product, but I will not use any other cleanser like this, but this kind of cleanser on my face. I have really sensitive skin. It is fragrance, alcohol and colour free, so it's a lot more gentle on the skin. So what I do is I rub these two pads together so they absorb the product. And then on this side, I just do the same again and go in circles on that earth of my face. And then the same on this side. And to wipe off the cleansing lotion, I use the Dermovio Micellar Cleansing Water. I will show you what it looks like very shortly looks like this you can get it from the pound shop savers i think they sell it at body care they also do a face wash which i, I also use because it's for sensitive skin i just put a little bit on each pad and just do a quick wipe now the last thing i do is tone so i use the kind and gentle facial toner from asda um the Kind and Gentle range is quite cheap, it's only like 99 pence per item. So if you're on a budget and you don't have that much money but you want your skin to look nice, I would actually recommend this range beyond belief. They have a foaming face wash. Um, Yeah, I just basically do this with my... I just do the same as the nice little water, just give it a good wipe. Um, I basically just... Um, They have all sorts for the range and I, I couldn't actually rave about them any more than I do. The second thing I use is the Kind and Gentle Light Moisturiser by, you guessed it, Asda. The fact that it is scent free and is free of alcohol and stuff like that is amazing. So I just rub this moisturiser in a circular motion along my skin whilst pushing up. I was told by a dermatologist, if you pull your skin downwards, you can cause premature wrinkles and premature aging, especially along the neck. So, that's the moisturiser applied. Now, I'm going to use my night cream because it's, it's not bedtime, but it's too late for day cream. Um, I'm going to use a Radiance Night Cream from Asda. This one again is really cheap. Um, I think it's like £1.67 so I would say it's well worth the money. It's like a nice thick consistency. Um, and again just pushing it up. Mm. 
Um, the second thing I'm going to use is the sample. Well, the third thing, moisturizer wise. It's called the Anu Lime Erasing Serum for Anti Wrinkles. Um, so let's get my finger in there and just put some of this on. Does anybody else wonder why they put so much in a sample sachet? I mean, you're not going to use this entire sachet on your face. You can't exactly fold it up and save it for later because that means the product go bad. So you just keep having to apply and apply and apply. But I have heard really good things about this, so I have really high hopes. If you are worried about wrinkles or anything, I would actually give this a try because this I think this is like the fifth sample I've tried. And I did have really, really prominent forehead wrinkles here when I frowned or smiled or made any sort of facial expression. Like they're still there, but they're not as prom I've noticed they're not actually as prominent as what they used to be. So even though they are still there. It's actually making a really good effect on them. So again, because I don't know if it has a sample size link, I'm gonna to have to link the full size product down below. Um the third to last product that I use is the Revolution Hyaluronic Acid. Now I know people are thinking that this is a lot of products put in your face if you've got sensitive skin. But I have seen women on YouTube with a lot worse skin than me putting twice as many products as what I'm putting on my skin onto theirs. So I thought it's figuratively normal. So that one I just basically just pressed into my skin with a little bit of force. Seem to have lost my backpack. Yeah. Um. So after I've put all the facial products on, I go to my lips and I use the Nivea Original Cur. So it's. Just put that on my lips. And the final thing, but certainly not the least that I put on my skin, is the Anu Lift and Firm Eye Lift System. Now I have um, oh, I don't know if you guys can tell, but here I have a hooded eyelid. Um, so, but I've I use this this bit is for oh, it's really realistically do it this way. This bit's for the top. This bit's for the bottom. Just get your finger in. you don't need a lot of product is it if you're not a fan of this kind of thing i will send out it is quite a thick formula but i recently put up a video of um products that i'm reviewing at the minute from avon because i'm an avon representative and some i've loved and adored some of them i liked and recommended but because I don't actually use the products normally on a day to day basis I've not really spoke about them as much but the eye lift system so far is really working for me so the actual official review will be up in a couple of days Um, this video will probably be up right Saturday today this one will probably be up Monday I'll upload this in the morning on Monday before I head to work I'm going to put my glasses back on because I can't see a pissing thing. Um, so yeah, that is my real-time skincare routine. Um, for those who are wondering, um, this top I am wearing in the video before it because I am pre-filming videos. Which means I'm going to film a few videos today and post them a couple of days later. This won't be done with reviews or anything like that because I want to do that properly. I mean things like... My new job, details of that, once I start. Um, what I do in the day-to-day -day life. What kind of things I do in my spare time when I don't have my son. So, 
I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and subscribe. It really does mean a lot for you if you do that. To me, if you do that. So, th this is Claire from My Mad Little World. I hope you have a very brilliant night's sleep or a great day. Um, so, goodbye.